Hey guys, this is Puppet and here at my Galaxy S5 here running Android 7.1.1 Nougat with Lineage OS and this thing goes really fast with it. Um, I haven't set it up yet and it's currently off so I'm going to go ahead and turn it on real quick. And one thing I noticed was that it says set warranty bit kernel. Um, I am on SignGen Mod 13 it didn't have that so just worth something to point out. And uh, as you can see, it's going to take like, a couple seconds. It just vibrated, meaning that it's about to load in. I've already booted up once, so like it um, did that first setup process, but I still haven't gone through setup. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, go through setup and connect to Wi-Fi, and I'll be right back. All right, so I've just set it up, as you can see. And this thing's just running buttery smooth. Um, only thing I encountered when setting up was the... Fingerprint sensor would not work. Um, it said uh, swipe your finger to enroll and it said enrollment failed. So it worked in old earlier build. I don't know what's up with that. So just look out for that. So I'm just going to go over the stock apps to show you the general performance of it. So I'm just going to hit close these real quick. Hit open audio FX browser. This is go to Reddit. Um, should only take a second. It's a little slow on this. I think it's just the browser app. I don't think it's the phone. Um, next, we'll do calculator. Go, go ahead and open clock. Open camera. Camera's fully functional as well. As you can see, uh, switch cameras real quick. Switch cameras real quick. There we go. Take a picture. View it. Let's see. Um, next, we're gonna go. Next, we're gonna go ahead and go to files. Uh, phone, messenger, messages, messaging. I don't know. And now we're just gonna go ahead and go to the first one, and just go on from here. See if it's all running in the background, which it seems to be. So as you can see, multitasking works pretty well. The RAM management is pretty good. So now we're going to go into some more intensive apps. So we're going to go ahead and go to Clash Royale, why not? And we're going to see if it runs in the background. Yeah. Uh, I haven't set this up before, so it's going to take an extra second or so. Come on, buddy. Alright, and there we go. So... I mean, I didn't install Google Play Games, I installed the Pico app, it, or I don't know how it's called, what it's called. I installed the smallest package on the GAPS website. Um, so as you can see, it's running just fine. Uh, let's do this real quick. Um, it's running at 60 FPS, by the way. The camera's running at 30 FPS, I think I mentioned that. So, um, just worth noting. So, we're going to go ahead and close this and open up a YouTube video. I'm going to go ahead and do a 60 FPS video real quick. I'm going to go pull it up. Well, my phone wasn't actually recording when I thought it was recording, so we left off at the YouTube part. Um, so, I finished the video without realizing that it wasn't recording. So, um, I think these are the apps that were running in the background before. I had to open them all back up. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and run the 60 FPS video real quick. And, as I mentioned earlier, this is a 30fps video, so it won't be picking up the 60fps, but you can see we're not dropping any frames at all, which is awesome. Um, on 6.0, it did drop a couple of frames here and there, but it it's not having any trouble at all. So, let's just go ahead and see if Clash Royale is running. No, it's not. Okay. Um, when I thought I was recording, everything worked. Uh, everything was in the background, but, you know, whatever. So, let's go do that. Um, do this. And to go back to Chrome. Chrome's still running in the background. Uh, Google Play's running in the background. Phone's not running in the background. Okay. Messaging is. Browser is. Camera is. And YouTube should be, too. Take a second. And... 
I think it deleted that from the RAM, but the app itself is open, so I guess I'll give it some points there. Okay, and let's see, Clash Royale should, and it's not open. So I think it's whenever I uh, started watching the video, it took too much RAM, so it killed Clash Royale. So next we're just going to see if the phone actually works. I believe it's star 2. Let's see. Welcome to Sprint. Bye. Yep. So that works. Um, so that's about it. I think. Oh, wait, no. I think I forgot to show this. Yeah. As you can see, it is Android Nougat. Get the Easter egg. Come on. There we go. Got the little cat. So... That's about it. I so hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next weekend.